Hey folks, Jordy here for Premiere Basics and today we're gonna create a paper collage effect as seen in the K-pop music video Rock With You by Seventeen. And definitely stick around till the end because I got a little surprise for you all. Now, before we're gonna head over to Premiere Pro, we first need our assets to make this paper effect and so we need a photo of a simple paper tier. Now you can download these from Storyblocks, yes they also have an image library and you can actually get their three libraries in one subscription, this is the most valuable and I'll leave a link to it in the description down below, I can highly recommend it guys. Or you can also just make them yourself like I'll be doing. All that you need is a black surface, a white paper and your camera to snap a picture. Or you can also use your phone obviously. I start ripping a shape out of a paper, something that you want to use later in the edit. And you can be creative with this, try different shapes, straight or more wavy edges, clean or dirty tears, whatever you want. Then lay down your tiered paper on the black surface and snap a picture from it above. Just make sure that it's evenly lit and that's it. We can now go ahead and fire up Adobe Premiere Pro. Just make sure your paper doesn't catch fire. <laughs> now first of all drag your clip in the timeline on video track number 2. Then look for the frame that you want to use for this effect, I'm happy with this one. So right click on the frame and select add frame hold. You can now delete the part on the left since we don't need that anymore. Now with the clip ready, we can now add the paper rib onto it. Drag the paper to your picture into the timeline right above your clip. And we're gonna use this as a mat in order to cut out a piece from our clip. But let's do some tweaking first. With the picture selected, we head over to the Lumetri panel and play around with the exposure, contrast, shadows and blacks to get a high contrast image. The blacks need to be black as that will be removed later on. The paper itself doesn't have to be 100% white. If you have some difference in the bright is there, it's okay since it will add an overall texture to the photo. Then let's head over to the effects window, look for the track matte key effect and drag it to the video clip. With this clip selected, head over to the effects controls panel to change some settings from that effect. Set the matte to video tree, which is a paper photo, and the composite using to matte luma. And there we go, our picture is ripped as it's using the picture as the mask. And now you can use the position, the rotation and scale properties of the paper tier to place it wherever you want. Now of course we are missing the white of the paper tier itself, so let's add that in now. Hold down alt as you drag the paper tier picture to video track 1. With this clip selected, head over to the effects controls panel and remove the Lumetri color effect since we don't need that high contrast anymore. Now scale it up a little bit so that it comes out from behind of the picture. And it's easy as that. However, we have one more issue that we need to resolve. If you would place a background behind it, you can see that the black of the background is still visible. But we can easily remove that. Go over to the effects panel and look for the luma key effect. Drag this onto the paper tier from video track 1 and our problem is solved. And now let your creativity flow and create a cool montage with this effect just like this. Now that looked pretty awesome, right? And as you probably noticed, we also added some extra details in there, like this overall crumble effect. We created this asset ourselves, just like we did with the paper tier, it's a photo. You can place it on top of the entire edit and change the blending mode to soft light. That's really it. The pieces of tape are also extremely easy to add. We just took a picture of some tape on that black place map. This picture then went above the edit and I changed the blending mode to screen. Now, as promised, I got a little surprise for you all. All the photos that I took, like the papers and the tape, can be downloaded from a link in the description down below. A nice pack filled with paper crumbles, torn out shapes, full screen tiers and pieces of tape that can be downloaded for free. And if you're gonna use it for commercial purposes, then there's a small fee of just $9 which also helps support the channel. Link in the description down below. So enjoy that pack guys, big thanks for watching and as always, stay creative.